no candidate will be proposed in the first Catalan presidential investiture debate, as neither socialist Salvador Illa or pro-independence Carlos Puigdemont have enough support. This is Catalan News in 100 seconds. Next Tuesday, there will be a parliamentary session to start a two-month election countdown. If no president is named by August 25th, there will be another vote in October. Socialist Salvador Illa won the election, but fell short of an absolute majority. The Catalan government has lifted further drought restrictions. Recent rains have more than doubled reservoirs water supplies in the last two months. En condicions normals no ha de significar cap problema fer un consum estàndard dels darrers estius eh, per les reserves, per les reserves d'aigua. Beaches in the metropolitan area are facing a summer with 20% less sand compared to last year. Recent storms have complicated the season and local authorities call for urgent measures to solve the problem. Up to 20% of beach showers will open this year as the drought improves. Barcelona will host the start of the 2026 Tour de France, the Grand Depart. The first three stages will take place in Catalonia between July 4th and 6th. Barcelona has already hosted some of the stages of the Tour de France in the past, but not the Grand Depart. Mais parce que c'est une ville magnifique, parce que c'est une ville de prestige, et que le Tour de France a besoin de se nourrir aussi de grands départs de prestige. Merci pour votre constance. The Barcelona City Council is asking drivers to avoid the city centre ahead of tomorrow's Formula One roadshow. Many public transport routes will also be affected ahead of an event that will see Formula One cars driving on Passeig de Gracia Boulevard. The Pride demonstration will take place in Barcelona's Gran Via on July 20th. This will be a change compared to previous protests, as it will finish at the Passeig Luis Companys Boulevard instead of Plaza España.